I could speak one more source vibration within me. Okay, this is like way back 2000. Oh, I have a lot. I I wrote all of these things in my manuscript 2013 where everything stops and <laughs> with my command all that because I read the whole book of Dr. Wayne Dyer that um change your thought and change your life. Oh, I made a I have a book for that. I love to have someone to do a movie on that. Because it is the reality of how I connect to my mind, to the beauty of my mind. And it's all there is. That's all. You don't have to do nothing. No resistance, no doubts, nothing. It's just you act as you are a child of God. This is, for me, it's my natural state of mind. I'm glad. I am so fortunate that humble, blissful enough that I am in this that it just keeps popping up all this goodness. Um, <laughs> I don't know which one I have to talk with so much of them. <laughs> all my life, every day is a miracle for me. Oh. Which one? Oh, I have to think about that shingles. You know shingles, guys? The shingles could be at the back of your uh back here in your spinal cord and just like uh little round thing like uh there's a fuss in it very painful okay and then uh that's part of a shingles too but i don't have that then i said in my here was it yeah in my left ear I found this one day that this, it hurts when I use the cotton buds. It's something inside that hurts. It's like it's hurting you. So I ignore. I ignore. And then the next day, next day, and I said to someone, can you look at what is happening in here? It's like I have like a pimple inside. Um, so someone did look at it. I said, oh, yeah, you got a lot of little pimples. I wonder what that is. And I said, I know. I felt it. Whole, the whole body of myself so you know i'm a toler i'm tolerant i'm a tolerance of this pain so i just ignore it and i just uh, it will come to pass it will go that's how i said and then i think after one week it's just getting into my nerves and <laughs> something here i said oh my god what's this and then then slowly i have this um like a little one in my here like uh, little pimples and it hurts when you touch it so i have to take some uh, like uh, paracetamol just to take or advil whatever because i'm 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 not i'm not a medicine guy i don't go jump on medicine and go to doctor I, if i could heal myself then i do that because i really trusted myself because God is in me and all that healing power. It's us in the nervous system and all that spinal cord. So, well, it's getting dark. I think it's getting dark here. Um, after one week or almost two weeks, I went to the doctor because it didn't go away. And it's just like, I can't, I can't swallow. I can't drink water anymore. It's like my nerves is damaged because of that thing. So when I went to other doctor, the other one, the lady, she's an Indian lady, and she just gave me this blah, 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 because it's like mild thing. And then I said, oh, is something really wrong? Then I went to the other doctor, this uh, Dr. Soliman, and, and he told me, who's the doctor that gave you this medicine? This is not right. This is not for that. That is a serious matter, he told me. Do you know that? I said, I don't know. I just know that. The pain didn't go away, and it's just having all this, uh, am I having no more battery? Oh, okay. And the pain is just, let me, oh, okay. Getting dark here. Never go away, so I went to that doctor, he said, and then he gave me an antibiotic right away. Oh, that is a serious matter. It can damage two of your uh, nerves in there, and because it's close to your brain, you can it can kill yourself. I said, oh, that's serious. I just, 
do like that. Okay, now I have to be serious then. I have to take this um, antibiotic, blah, blah, blah. But the antibiotic seems like it's not helping me because um, I have this tolerance of pain. So when I saw this, um, it just happened that when I opened my uh, Facebook, I saw this uh, with Dr. Wayne Dyer, my mentor in spirituality, um, with Nick Ortner, 2000. 14 I believe and um, because of this emotional freedom technique EFT so that's how I learned that 2013 I guess and then I learned that and I tried to copycat and I do this ch chop karate chop and uh, do like that seriously and then with my faith and strong faith and belief that God helped me I need your help now guys this is not just a joke this is serious the doctor said it can kill me so I don't want to be that I want to, I don't want to die now okay so that's what I said to myself I, I love talking to myself people might think I'm crazy but I love talking to my dear ones inside of me they always give me the smiles and the assurance and all that stuff so I do that karate chop you know why is it so painful like that? <laughs> this is what I do and I'm teaching everyone below the here and then underneath the arms. It works, it works and I did it two or three times and then oh my god it swells up my uh, this part. It's really getting big as it's something really serious here. So I have to be serious now. So I do uh, the tapping emotional freedom technique. It was 2013 or 14, uh, but it doesn't matter. I go beyond space and time reality anyway. So, but that's what I did. And then um, after one day, two days, oh, it numbs. I didn't feel the pain, even though it's swollen, but I didn't feel the pain. So really it was taking out the pain because of what I did. And I believe in that and I have my faith. Okay, uh, there you go. Answered prayer and because I have strong confidence that I am the healer. The healer of myself is the Holy Spirit that dwells in me. So that I can call upon that. It's getting light here. It's night time. That's why it's getting dark. But it was one. I have another one also about the regarding the root canal. Oh, next time, guys. I have so much to share. Because I am filled with love, joy, peace. I love you. I love you, my beloveds, dear ones. Thank you. Love you. Mwah. Mwah.